Hi, everybody. I'm the Old Humble Guy. Welcome back. Today, uh, we're going to talk about decanters. Uh, do they do anything? What exactly is it that they do? Uh, and is it worth the money? Uh, so decanters, it's a glass bottle. I mean, it's no different than this glass bottle. So yes, they absolutely do something. They do something for wine specifically. And what they do for wine is it gives the wine an opportunity to uh, open up uh, experience the air, encounter the air, and uh, oxidize. Opens up the flavors, uh, and it begins to uh, alter the flavor of that wine. Of course, wine is mostly juice. Uh, we know this. Wine is mostly juice and a little bit of alcohol. Whiskey, on the other hand, is mostly water, uh, between 60% uh, water and you know maybe a little bit less than that, depending if you go with cast strings. It could be 40% water. Uh, the rest of it's alcohol. Very little juice in most whiskeys. Uh, if you're buying normal whiskey like normal people. Uh, so this isn't going to oxidize the same way that wine is going to oxidize. What's going to happen with your high alcohol content uh, whiskeys is that it's going to begin to evaporate uh, after a few days. So this is a cork and this is a glass stopper. This is not sealed the same way that this is sealed. So when it sits in this bottle, it's not likely to evaporate. When it sits in this bottle, it will evaporate over time. So does it do something? Yes. Does it do something good for your whiskey? Not exactly. The longer it sits in this uh, container, the, the more it evaporates and the more actual alcohol you lose out of your decanter. Um, so is it anything good? Not really. Uh, but if you're, if you're, if, if you're having like a dinner party and you want a nice presentation and you have some matching glasses to go with your decanter, then by all means, get a decanter, have your nice fancy dinner party and your nice fancy presentation. But if you have a good bottle of whiskey and you want to show off the label and the good bottle of whiskey that you bought for that dinner party, you may want to go ahead and keep it in the bottle. Um, now, if you have a, 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 a little bit less good bottle of whiskey, maybe you want to hide the label and put it in the decanter. Maybe. I mean, I don't fully recommend buying bad bottles of whiskey. Uh, but, you know, that's an idea. Now, the, the next question, the third question is, is it worth the money? Uh, you know, you can get decanters for $20, $30, bucks, $25, $35. Uh, I have decanters that, are, that have sealed corks that are very nice decanters, and they're really good for display. Uh, they're good for display, they're good for decoration, and they're good for storage because that cork is sealed. If you get a decanter for storing your whiskey uh, for decoration, because it's a nice you know, centerpiece type of uh, decanter, by all means, go for it. It's a nice decoration piece. You can store it, and it has a sealed cork, so it's not going to evaporate that whiskey. But if it's just a, if it's just a, a showpiece with a glass stopper, I don't think it's really worth the money. For my money, if I'm going to spend 40, 50, 60 bucks on a decanter, I'm going to go buy a couple of bottles of whiskey myself. Uh, now, again, decoration, uh, presentation, that sort of stuff, it's kind of subjective. But again, for my money, I'd rather put that money into the whiskey uh, and then, you know, share a really good whiskey uh, with my friends and uh, family. So there you go. I appreciate you guys coming by. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll do more of these. We'll have another talk. Cheers to all you fine folks out there. We'll see you again soon.